Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today we're going to be working with Baxter on his go to bed. Now, what we're going to be doing today is putting Baxter in a go to bed, and the goal here is that I'm going to use the door behind me as a distraction to open and close it. Now, we've done a similar exercise like this in the past, but the difference is that we change the environment, so we're going to take that into consideration when we're working with Baxter today. So, I'm going to go ahead, toss some food. Baxter, go to bed. I'm going to wait for him. Yes. Stay. And you see I'm treating low to the ground and then telling him to stay with a flat palm. Now I'm going to go ahead and walk over to the door. Yes. And I'm just going to start with turning the knob. Stay. You see each time I create a distraction. Yes. I'm treating Baxter. Stay. And then reiterating that stay. Stay is one of the few commands that we can repeat when necessary, and this is one of those instances. Yes. Stay. We're going to do this a couple more times. Yes. Stay. Yes. Stay. Now I'm going to go ahead and start opening the door. So I'm just going to crack it open. Yes. Stay. Yes. See, Baxter's doing very nice. I love, say, that he's in a relaxed position. You see his hip is actually rolled over. That's an excellent sign with any kind of downstay position. Stay. Yes. All right, we're going to do that one more time. Stay. Yes. I'm going to go ahead, tap on the head to release. OK. And that was a very nice job from Baxter. So you see, he did a great job keeping his position as I open and close the door behind me. Overall, really nice job from Baxter today. Good job.